Diapolio just made an ad that completely destroys it. This ad is surgical precision against Justin Trudeau and the Liberals. Now, I keep wondering sometimes, why is there still people voting for the Liberals? Are they, like, just watching fake news and they actually believe everything they see? I think that, empirically, it's unlikely Canada is becoming less safe. Minister of Justice and Attorney General of Canada told Reuters in an interview on Monday, July 31, 2023. When I saw that, I was like, <clears throat> Do you go outside sometimes? T July 25. 2024, violent crime Canada up 50%, extortion up 357%, violent firearm offenses up 116%. That's after he banned guns, by the way. Auto theft up, up plus 46%. There was already a lot. Sexual assaults plus 75%. I'm just letting you guys know that most of these assaults were not done by white men. You can go see the race for yourself. Not Canadian. Now, let's have a look. Pierre Polyev's surgical precision ad that just came out against the Liberals. It is clean, just perfect. Four people injured, no one in custody. Has your car been stolen in Canada? Well, you might not be the only one, as it's currently the car theft capital of the world. It's come to this. Thieves busting down doors to steal car keys. There has been a dramatic rise in the number of carjackings right across the GTA. In total, five people were shot, some multiple times. All were rushed to hospital. Some guy's up before a judge for having stolen a car, gets let off and went into the parking lot of the courthouse and stole another car. You can't make this stuff up. Trudeau's catch and release justice system is not worth the crime. Did you see the people that were arrested doing over 150 what, the, what was uh, the race? Not Canadian. Most of these people were all migrants. They were literally all migrants. All of them. They come in here and start a ring of people like stealing cars, going inside homes, taking the keys. They would break into homes to steal the car keys and leave with the car with the keys. This guy in court gets arrested for stealing a car. Passes in front of the judge, gets released. He goes into the underground parking lot of the court and steals another car. Just after he got released. Let that sink in. Anyone who votes for the liberals, who actually believes Canada is safe in most cities, you're, you're either extremely stupid or gullible, one or the other. And I think it's a little bit of both. I can't believe there's still people voting for, for this crap. Like, where do you live to see Canada as a good, like, peaceful place? Are you living in the, in the woods? What you know, stuff on crime. He increased the duration of the prison uh, time that people do for violent crimes. Yeah, but he removed the mandatory prison time. There's no manda mandatory prison time. It's not a two years minimum. There's no prison time minimum. He increases the prison, he increased the prison time you can do for violent crimes, but removed the minimum. A liberal judge is not going to send you to jail if you're Spanish, Black, Native. Oh, you're a victim of systematic racism, even though you're a migrant from another country. Like, Jesus Christ, man. That's not making sense. We need to vote this guy out ASAP.